At Cedar Lane School in Vienna, there is no doubt that the library is the heart of the building. Cedar Lane is a high school that serves special education students who face a variety of challenges from emotional and learning disabilities to high-functioning autism. And the staff members at Cedar Lane believe that a quiet, safe environment is vital to student success. The library plays a very important role at Cedar Lane. Frequently, students are accepted into Cedar Lane throughout the academic year. So we receive some students in September all the way through the month of May. So we have found that the library serves as a mecca. It is the heart of Cedar Lane School. The work of Ms. Hallman, as well as Mr. Mitri, has provided a safe haven for many of our students. We invite teachers to bring their students into the library as a class group. I also work with students individually on their projects. Um, whatever the teachers are working on, I share information with them that was going to help them promote what they're doing in their classroom, and then the students come to the library. The research that I was gathering today was on Langston Hughes with two of my uh, teammates uh, that were in my class, and we were learning about the poet and his work and where he grew up and all that. Ms. Hellman's helpful a lot. She helps us understand the type of books that we're looking at and all the type of sources that we need to find. Five, four, three, two, one, you're on. Another way the library empowers students and makes them feel comfortable is through the news show that is broadcasted throughout the school each morning. See, the morning news show is on every morning um, during homeroom and we talk about like people's birthdays, upcoming events, drawings for prizes, weather reports, lunch. We have a lot of videos on there and we have guest speakers. It's all live. We have people running in the back doing the camera and controls. Well, they have organizational skills that they have to follow, uh, especially with the tape playback that we have. Uh, you saw they have to be able to listen for cues, they have to be able to organize a series of tapes to play in sequence, they have to be able to um, you know, read the script and uh, follow the directions that are being given from behind the camera. It's a performance thing where you have to perform on cue right away, which um, is good for our kids because it, it gives them some structure uh, and it allows them to be able to follow a sequence of events and perform and, and do that show successful. What I like about the new show is that it's like a morning coffee and it's a chance to go up and like in front of people and express yourself also to show that you have talent and to be able to give information to kids who usually don't you know, watch the news. Now I'm just right there and part of it and it's just part of a goal to do that. It's really uprising. The library's reach Thank extends you. to classrooms, as Mrs. Hellman frequently gives teachers valuable resources to further engage the students. She is very supportive to our teachers. She participates in our collaborative learning teams for the four core subject areas, as well as electives. She is constantly giving them creative ideas to help with the instructional process. I enjoy doing the research, I, so going to dis discovery education using a smart board lesson or uh, something that I've learned with uh, by attending the um, librarians meetings. I always bring that back to our teachers, something that's going to help enhance their program, enhance what they're doing for our students. But at the end of the day, the library's main goal is to provide a welcoming, stress-free environment where students can thrive. I think it's important for the library to be here because it's a quiet place, it's a safe environment, um, people can come in here and relax from like a stressful class or a stressful situation. There's books in here for people who love to read like me. It's just a calming place. Ms. Hallman and Ms. Mitra are very helpful because, you know, they, um, they get me in very interested in lots of different activities. Like, Mr. Mitra would get me interested in the new show. Like, I get to be up in front of the mic or be do it behind the scenes. Ms. Hallman is very helpful because um, I ask her a lot of questions. I ask her questions if I need any help finding a book or anything. And she will have the exact thing that I'm looking for. If not, then she'll let me know. The culture that I wanted to create here at Cedar Lane School was one that of uh, students being empowered 
and feeling valued and also knowing that this is theirs. I actually support them. So the library is actually theirs.